You're watching News 13 with Amy Hoyt, Jerry Brown, Courtney Mims, and Chief Meteorologist Ross Whitley. Bay District Schools is working to help students and staff with mental health issues after the hurricane through education. The school board being presented with a comprehensive plan to educate students from kindergarten through high school about various mental health and safety issues. The school district says as of October, there have been 80 Baker Act incidents so far and over 3,000 students have been identified as homeless. The school district is hoping to combat declining mental health by working with local partners to educate the kids. There's some things we put together with the health department and some other things to try to help our students uh, understand what they're dealing with and the challenges they're facing. Along with the educational programs, telemental health kiosks have also been set up by First Lady of Florida, Casey DeSantis's mental health initiative. So far, there are 38 kiosks with 30 school staff members trained on how to use them. The district reports two therapy intake sessions have been completed with those kiosks. The Bay County Division of the Florida Department of Health reopened its Women, Infants and Children remote office in Southport today. This comes after reopening the remote office in Springfield mid-October. The office opened at the Dove Church off of Highway 77 in Southport, the same location they used before the storm. The Dove Church just completed its roof repairs and has welcomed the department back in to continue its work. The clients have been very excited that we're back in this area because it makes it a lot more accessible to clients that live in this area. To learn more about operating days and how to schedule an appointment, visit our website, mypanhandle.com. It's been over a year since Hurricane Michael and many Panhandle residents are still dealing with the aftermath, including legal issues. Tonight, free legal help is on the way. Legal Services of Northwest Florida is trying to help. They are partnering with Doorways of Northwest Florida to host a free legal clinic called Justice on the Block. It's this Friday, October 25th. Attorneys from across the panhandle will gather at the Bay County Public Library to offer free legal advice to Hurricane Michael victims. The attorneys specialize in FEMA claims, insurance issues, contractor issues, landlord tenant problems and much more. A lot of people can't afford a private attorney or don't even realize that they have a legal matter that they need assistance with. And many times the issue that they have can be quickly and easily resolved just by talking with an attorney for a few minutes. Chestnut says to bring any documentation, photographs and paperwork related to your questions. The attorneys will be at the Bay County Public Library from 1 to 4 this Friday.